Welcome back, Hornets. It's Abby and Jackson, live from 205 Rebooted. Today is February 9th, 2024. In five more days, we will see that love is in the air. Make sure to celebrate it with someone special. Did you know that the first Valentine was written from a prison? Charles, Duke of Orleans, wrote the love letter to his second wife at the age of 21 while captured at the Battle of Agincourt. As we all know, chocolate is a universal gift on Valentine's Day. A student from our class recently showed us their love for chocolate and the recipe of how to make homemade Reese's. Let's take a look. That's cool, but nothing will ever beat a classic box of chocolate. On this day in TV history, the Beatles made their first appearance on The Ed Sullivan Show. This broadcast drew 73.7 million views. The Beatles have made 14 songs about love. Their most popular one was there, Here, There, and Everywhere. This was about a man obsessed with the feeling of love. The Spanish Club is doing a balloon sale only for $3 a pop, no pun intended, and they will be delivered on Valentine's Day during homeroom on day two. You can't forget about the 2024 Valentine's Day carnation sale. During lunch, you can buy a carnation for $2 to send anonymously or to your friends or someone special. In our new and approved Live from 205 crew, this class is enriched with talent, so we decided to see who could draw the best PV Hornet from memory. I'm pretty sure I won. Sure, bud. Let's take a look at the results now. Okay, so we're here with the one and only Jackson. And now here we have Genesis. Next person we have, the one and only Harry. So we're here with Gianna now. We're also here with Sajida. We're also here with Judah. Uh, for today, a very, very special event we have. It's gonna be, who can draw the PV Hornet the best in this class? So Jackson already knows now. Um, he hasn't been able to see it at all, but the only restriction is, is that it's only one minute. And so you're only gonna have one minute to draw it. You're gonna be able to see and watch with him. So you wanna start now? Yeah, I'll yeah. start your timer. Yeah, yeah. All right, three. Two, one, go. Dang, kind of started off fast. Okay, it's pretty solid. Pretty solid start. Okay, very detailed approach by Judy here. All right, I'll, I'll give you a, a, a few hints. He has legs and he also has wings. I, I see I see the vision, I see the vision. But I'll give you a hint, he has at, at least one leg. Legs. He has legs, 10 seconds left. 
cool he remembered the legs. I feel like the, the last two people didn't really remember the legs too well. Uh, he has some antennas, so I can do that. And some stripes as well. Okay, okay. 15 seconds left. Is, is, that, is that your finished product? Do you want to put any details on it? I'll, I'll also give you another hint. There's legs. That's it? You gonna add anything else? No. Okay. You, have, you still have 15 seconds left? Just uh, I'll put this up right here. Wow. That's a, that's a pre pre pretty good, I mean, pretty solid. Pretty solid, I'd say. Uh, you see Harry, Harry's Hornet here. He even got the boxing gloves too, with the, the legs. That That's your Hornet right there. You, you wanna just hold it up real quick? This is Genesis, Genesis's Hornet. <laughs> this is Judah's Hornet. Are you proud of what you've drawn today? Kind of. I mean, it's not, it's not too bad. It's not as bad as I thought. Okay. I mean, well, we're now going to go on to the voting. We've gotten everybody uh, ready. And so uh, we'll tally up the votes. We'll see who really is the, the most artistic in this class. So we will see you there. And for your top three winners of this Drawing the Hornet Best Contest, starting with number three, we got... Sajida, congrats. And now for the second place in the drawing, the Hornet's Best Contest is Jackson. Congratulations for the moment of truth. We got for first place, we have Gianna. Congrats for drawing the best Hornet of 2024. Thank you to those students who made these interesting videos. We'll see you in a bit. Chatty bye.